What we're seeing out here is our tallgrass prairie preserve. Once we get into July, we have this beautiful green oasis of wildflowers and grasses and wildlife uh, that call Winnipeg home. The Living Prairie Museum is a remnant tallgrass prairie. So this is a site of tallgrass prairie that's never been plowed up. It's a snapshot of sort of the history of the types of habitat that we used to have here in southern Manitoba. And the Interpretive Center's been open since 1976. These are insects that have been collected in prairie remnants around the city of Winnipeg. This collection has about 2,000 specimens so far. Really hard to pick a favorite. In terms of impressive, the Nevada bumblebee, they are huge. Um, the queens look a little bit like a baby mouse. The Living Prairie Museum has a herbarium collection of dried plant specimens from habitats around the Winnipeg region. We have about 350 dried plant specimens. They offer us a lot of information about the biodiversity that we might have in an area. And this room is used to grow prairie plants from seed. Uh, all of these little seedlings here end up either in our uh, restorations throughout the city of Winnipeg or they go to our seed plots that we have in St. Norbert to help us produce even more native seed. A lot of people won't see this habitat in their lifetime so it's pretty wonderful to have this here for Winnipeggers to enjoy. We're located at 2795 Ness Avenue. Uh, you can find more information on our website. It's winnipeg.ca slash livingprairie.